up? It's your girl, Billy Marie. Oh my gosh, y'all. My arms are so tired, but these finger coils were so worth it. Now, or your arms are gonna be sore. They're gonna be burning. This definition, where are you gonna find more definition like that, y'all? This little detangler brush thingy here saved my life. And it's so cute. Look at that little design on the back. It's so cute. I got it from my local beauty supply store for like $5.99 or something like that. It's thebomb.com. Okay. And y'all know my favorite combo, like peanut butter and jelly, baby. You put these two things together with your handy dandy water bottle. Oh, you cannot go wrong. You cannot go wrong. I'm telling you, your curls going to be popping just like this. We about to do this. Okay. Eco style gel. Curl Enhancing Smoothie, got my Tangle Brush, got my Water Bottle, and I got my hair section into four sections. And I got one out because that's where I'm going to start in the back. I'm going to take my hair and I'm going to part it as you would do if you were flat ironing it. And I'm going to put a clip to hold it in place. Now I'm going to re-wet my hair because it's kind of getting dry. And I'm going to use my Curl Enhancing Smoothie first. And I'm going to work that in real good, you know. Get it all over. And then I'm going to take some Eco Style Gel. A good lump sum of it and just work that in as well and make sure you get the ends of your hair really good and watch this y'all watch how these curls just start popping automatically with this brush look at this Boop. and then I'm going to start taking small pieces and I'm going to start finger coiling them around my index finger I'm also taking a dab of extra gel on my finger so that I can keep the slickness because it's going to be hard to finger coil your hair if your hair is too dry or if you don't have enough gel or not enough water on it it's not going to curl correctly and everybody can finger coil differently but me personally I either use my fingertip or I use the middle of my finger for like longer strands I use the middle of my finger because it's, it's easier and it gets a, a better curl Versus then trying to work it from your fingertip. The smaller pieces you grab, I feel like the better your finger coil experience will be. If you grab two big pieces, like two larger pieces, it's harder to finger coil it. Depending on your hair texture. If you have, you know, silky kind of fine hair, you can probably grab bigger pieces. But I think if your hair is thicker and a little bit more coarse, you you're better off grabbing smaller pieces of, of, of hair. Now I'm just um, finishing up my finger coils. And if you're anything like me, your hair textures are different all throughout your head. As you can see in the front, I was really struggling to get my hair to curl. It wasn't as, as easy as the back was. But you know, that's how it is sometimes for your natural. You just gotta go with the flow. Now I'm grabbing my favorite shine gem and my bobby pins and I'm going to kind of make a little side part. I'm going to spray some oil in my hair because sometimes when you're using gel it can try to flake up or turn white which doesn't typically happen with this gel but just in case. Now I'm going to add that shine gem to this little side part that I put in my hair. You can put however much you want and I grab my edge brush and I'm going to just slick that over so I can kind of make it a little bit more defined and I'm just going to add some bobby pins so that it can hold my hair in place where I want it this is just the style that I wanted to achieve and this is the finished product look at those curls so defined you can't go wrong with finger coils I'm telling you Thanks for watching. I hope you guys learned something. Peace.